Well, very soon, farmers all across Connecticut will be allowing food stamp recipients to buy locally grown foods. Farmers will be registering this week. News 8's Tina Detail spoke with some farmers today about the plan. This wheat berry is grown by a local Ledyard farmer, Ike Farms, and now more people may have access to fresh produce like this. We're using lettuce, and over here was Claytonia. Teresa Schacht and her husband run Huntsbrook Farm and sell a lot of their crops at the Waterford Farmers Market, which accepts food stamps, a move she says has brought in more people over the years. You know, why do we farm? Because we want people to eat local and fresh mm -hmm. and how to get more, you know, get that to more people. Mm -hmm. um, the program allows for that. In addition to allowing food stamps through the USDA's SNAP program, folks can bring their state EBT card just like they would here at Fiddleheads in New London. At the farmer's market, they are given coins or coupons that can be spent with each farmer. Schacht says she has been able to really get to know her expanded customer base. Mm -hmm. Say they might look at their thing and like, oh, like that's like four dollars, and I only have like three dollars left. And we're like, go ahead, take it, it's fine. The program also helps farmers who have faced their own economic struggles. Warren Burrows of the Groton Family Farm chimed in from out of state. Wherever we can move our vegetables, it's terrific. Yeah, and it's just one more avenue to do it. Yes. People coming in that just their hearts sing because they, the variety at the markets is very different than um, our local supermarket during mm -hmm. the summer. To help local farmers like Provider Farm here in Salem become authorized to accept food stamps themselves, the USDA is holding merchant sign up days starting next week, and the state plans to do the same as well. In New London, Tina Detell, News 8.